भारत में ही अब जैसे लोगों को क्वेश्चन आता है दिमाग में कि हाउ कुड गांधारी गिव बर्थ टू हंड्रेड सन्स फॉर अल ह्यूमन वुमन सौ बच्चे कैसे पैदा कर सकते हो अगर आप एक एक साल में भी कर रहे हो यू आर प्रिटी ओल्ड यू नो यूर नॉट इट्स नॉट पॉसिबल ह्यूमनली सो उसकी भी स्टोरी है दैट यू नो शी डिड नॉट गिव बर्थ टू हंड्रेड सन्स शी एक्चुअली गिव बर्थ टू अनडेवलप्ड फीटर्स जिसको व्यास जो अगेन एक ऋषि थे and again i'm saying you know, again again jo rishis are they were the scientists of previous era you know wo jo vyas ek rishi the unhone aake us undeveloped jo fetus tha usko unhone 100 parts mein divide kiya 101 parts mein actually divide kiya and then they were put in a separate you know sort of incubators jo hum aaj ke hospitals mein dekhte hain jo neonates बच्चे जल्दी पैदा हो जाते हैं प्री टर्म बेबीज उनके उनको इंक्यूबेटर्स में रखा जाता है सो ही प्लेस देम इन अर्दन पॉट्स दैट वर फिल्ड विद वॉर्म ऑयल दे वर मेंटेन एट अ सर्टेन टेम्परेचर एंड उनको एक डार्क प्लेस में रखा गया था और वे द कॉरब व बॉर्न इज वेरी वेरी रेमिनेसेंट ऑफ क्लोनिंग यू नो वे यू टेक अ स्टेम सेल एंड यू क्रिएट न्यू यू नो फीटिस आउट ऑफ इट और न्यू बींग्स आउट ऑफ इट यू नो बिकॉज वंस दी स्टेम the stem cells can be converted into any type of cells and it is that came out ultimately was a dead mass of cells so these are probably stem cells you know fetus has stem cells primarily and this has a lot of application in science today in futuristic science where people are saying that you can freeze your stem cells and you can use it later in life when the technology becomes available if you want to regenerate some tissue etc etc but the fetus primarily was a source of these stem cells similarly for the pandavas you know we know that pandu was cursed that he will not be able to procreate whereas uh, you know by a rishi and if he try to uh, to have intercourse with his wives you know he would die that was the curse so how were the pandavas born they were born with the help of the gods and this is very similar to you know what is the story of the birth of jesus uh, you know and virgin mary why do we call her a virgin because jesus was not uh, conceived Uh, through her husband it was a angel gabriel who came i think it was gabriel it was an angel who came and uh, you know the uh, spirit of god it's called the immaculate conception is the same concept of the birth of pandavas kunti was a very uh, nice kid and she had taken care of durvasa rishi for a long time and durvasa rishi you know is a very very angry rishi he is notorious for giving curses left right and center but he was so happy Uh, with kunti service that he gave her some technology some mantra which she utilized to get these children from the gods but in scientific terms you know how do you how do you describe it there are multiple species in nature and there is a there's a term called parthenogenesis and you see it in a variety of species you know in you see it in snakes in fishes in amphibians in uh, certain birds in some reptiles etc where women alone you know the females alone can give rise to an offspring without the need of a male bahut sari aise descriptions hai hamare epics mein jo uh, clearly they point out to something scientific jo hum abhi tak realize nahi kar paye 